So right, what no. is the effect of iPhones in Papua New Guinea? Well, not, they haven't got iPhones, but they've got, they've got mobile phones. And, which, and, what, and it makes them give up gardening. Does it send out rays saying, do not garden, do not garden? Well, no, no. It's, it's, with new technology, they tend to um, be more interested in being connected to the rest of the world. I mean, you know, isolated island where they've grown up and um, they, don't, they don't want to labour in the fields like their parents did. So yeah, there is I don't blame them, frankly. Well, it's much more fun so to blame there, them. There, 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 is a, there, is a, there is a problem. Um, and, um, Although, mind you, I do some labouring in woodland. I'm custodian of a woodland in Wales. So maybe if they had more sense of ownership of the land... Oh, no, no, they own, they own, and definitely, every, everyone... There's owning uh, and owning, there's, right, there's right. owning under a serfdom system, no, no, in which, the, no, in which no. the quality of the land around you is being denuded and all the, mm. and all the rest of it, or the feeling that you're a real stakeholder in the future of this country, if, and if you've only got a small plot of vegetables, then you're not really a landowner. Yeah, no, no, uh, we're dealing with a, with a culture that's been going, you know, hundreds, thousands of years... And where would and, your and research on it be found? You have to wait for it still. It's, it's, um, it's, it's coming. Um, your, your my doctorate, your, your my, doctorate, my, doctorate huh? my doctorate, I sort of finished, but because of my... my, my anyway, basically, I, I'm, I've delayed putting it in. Um, I'm... Um, to the main anthropological journal. <laughs> um, no, no, publisher. No, 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 Sydney University, but... Um, All right, okay. You can find my other work on another people, more famous, the Trobrand Islands. I think I've talked about this. Yes, but anyway, what's interesting is these people are matrilineal, which is intriguing because matrilineal peoples, they're only about 16% of all societies are matrilineal. Mm -hmm. And they are always difficult in terms of marriage. Marriages can be difficult. And um, interestingly... Um, Women tend to have a higher status in matrilineal societies. Well, that makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah, well, it, well yes and no. Oh. Yeah, yes, you'd expect it, but a lot of earlier... Matrilineal societies well, weren't that way. Why, why would they do well, no, matrilineal if they're not mat making a statement about higher mat status? Mat matrilineal doesn't, in fact, mean women in power. It's not matriarchy. No, no, it's not matriarchy, but it's passing the yeah. possessions on the house. Yes, it does. It does. But, but, but there's a tendency for the brothers to be rather more important. So the brothers tend to have the power. I'm thinking off the top of my head, does matrilineal arise because it's easier to know um, who the mother of a child is for certain <laughs> than the father? Um, that, that, you know, is an evolutionary explanation. An evolutionary explanation. But um, no. Um, uh, how did it arise? Well, we, we don't know how it arose. How could, okay, what how do you could, think sustains it? Well, what, 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 what sustains it is um, the organisation is um, a kin group. And a kin group, where I was, this kin group was based on the susu, the basic, the breast. <laughs> After all, we come from a mother. Hang on, I'll just pull away so you can illustrate breast a little bit right. more. Okay. Thank you. Right, yeah, yeah. And, and um, what's intriguing is that there's a tendency for marriages to be fric a bit frictional because you have to, you are never quite accepted as a husband uh, into the family of your wife and, and, and vice versa. And so um, you, you live between two places. You've got to keep, you've got to keep a garden in your own village and a garden where your where your wife's village is. Oh, of course, so, well, that's split responsibility. And, and yeah. Ideally, you move every six months. Um, so. Bicycles have, have done more to increase the range of the genetic pool than any other invention in history. So, given that this is probably not a bicycle-based culture, no. what is the range between villages in which uh, responsibility for two gardens, uh, etc., occurs? Oh. Um, well, where I was, we were across um, a, oh, a great... Can I, can I break off our wonderful yes, interview and say, hello, Eileen, you're on camera again. <laughs>